One of the difficulties that many people experience at the beginning of working with current electricity is going between schematic diagrams and the reality of wiring a circuit. So we're going to start with one of the simplest circuits that we can do. A 6 volt battery, in this case a power box, a light switch, or just regular switch, a light bulb, and an ammeter. Finally with a voltmeter going around the light bulb. So we're just going to set that up right here. Now we've color coded some of the wires in the schematic, green and red, to help keep track of where this is going to be in our schematic diagram once we, once we get going. So, we're going to start out of the battery. We've put a green wire off the positive terminal of the battery. And so, we're going to do that right now. Going from the battery to the switch, which is our next component, we're going to use our green wires to come out to the battery and out the other side. And so we've got green wires coming from the battery to the switch, and now from the switch over to the light bulb, we're going to use another green wire. And out from the light bulb, and continuing on, also green. So now we're going to start working our way back to the battery. Now technically at this point, we would only need two more wires. Technically we could attach this green one over to our ammeter and then one back to the battery and that would be fine. But for now we're going to add an extra wire because as our circuits get more complex, sometimes it's easier to see where they branch from if we have a couple extra wires. And so we're going to continue from this point over to our ammeter. And so our ammeter, it has some very long wires that are going to continue off the screen. But for now, we'll have a red wire coming to here, and a red wire continuing from the other side of the ammeter back to the battery. And so here we go, completing the circuit back to the negative terminal using our red wires. We have a complete circuit now. So there's a little bit of the circuit that's continuing off camera here. And finally, we need a voltmeter to go around either side of our bulb. Now voltmeters don't come in for a long time. We just need to touch either side of it. And so whether our voltmeter is to the left or the right of our bulb, it doesn't actually make a big difference. So I'm going to simply put our voltmeter in here. How these meters work is something that we'll be working with later. And so these two are going to simply come on either side of the bulb. And so here they come. We get our reading and then we're going to remove it from the circuit. Voltmeters come in parallel. And so that's our first little bit of work going between a schematic diagram and reality. Battery to switch, positive terminal of the battery to switch. Switch to light bulb, switch to light bulb. Light bulb down to a red wire here. There's our reality. Into our ammeter. So it goes off camera, comes back in here, and then finally from our ammeter up to our negative terminal, around it goes and into the negative terminal of the battery.